We are converting between fractions and decimals. My learning target is I can generate equivalent forms of fractions and decimals using real world problems, including problems that involve money. Number one, Caroline and Christopher went trick or treating. They decided to divide the candy they got among their four family members. What decimal is equivalent to the fraction of candy each fam family member received? So each family, there's four family members, and each family member is one out of four. We are going to change that to a decimal. So we're going to do one divided by four. One goes into ten twice. One goes into 25 times. So that is 0 0.25. Number two, Ben and Jamie went to a race car race over the weekend. The cars completed seven of the 20 laps. What decimal is equivalent to the fraction of laps that the cars completed. So we have, they completed seven out of 20. So we are gonna do seven divided by 20. Seven, or 20 goes into 73 times. Goes into 100 five times. So that is 0 0.35. All right, number two, Jose and Viviana cleaned out their car. They found five dimes, two nickels, and 15 pennies. What fraction is the equivalent to the amount of money they found compared to a dollar? So five dimes, dimes are 10 cents a piece. So that would be 50 cents for five dimes. Two nickels is five cents a piece. So that would be 10 cents and 15 pennies, one cent a piece. So we are going to add those up. Okay, and then we're gonna change that to a fraction. So that's 75 hundredths. We're going to simplify. If we divide each by 25, we get three fourths. Number four, Kylie and her three college roommates went to the grocery store, so that's four of them. Their budget for their grocery store run was $50. Michaela paid one-fourth of the bill, Jacqueline paid three-eighths of the bill, and Kristen paid one-eighth of the bill. What decimal is equivalent to the fraction of the bill Kylie paid? So Kylie paid... So we have Michaela paid one fourth, Jacqueline paid three eighths. Write that a little better. Three eighths, and Kristen paid one eighth. So let's add all this together to figure out how much Kylie paid because she's going to pay what's ever left over. We have to have this as a common denominator. So two plus three is five. So total of six eighths. So that means Kylie paid two eighths. And then we have to figure out the decimal for that. So we have two divided by eight. So she, Kylie paid 0 0.25 of the bill. All right, the Garcia family is having a movie marathon over winter break. They plan to watch 25 movies. By the end of the first week, they have watched 0 0.42 movies. What fraction is equivalent to the decimal of movies they watched? 
So that is 42 hundredths. I'm going to divide this by two and see what we get there. That's 21 fiftieths, and we cannot simplify that anymore. Number six, what fraction is equivalent to 0 0.8 hundredths? It's 80 over 100. I'm going to divide this by 20. So that is four and fifths, four fifths.